An Indianapolis daycare teacher is waking up in her own home this morning after spending more than a week in the hospital. She was nearly killed by a hit and run driver. Our Alyssa Raymond joins us live this morning with what the woman has to say since finding out the person accused of hitting her is no longer in custody. Alyssa? Mm -hmm. And Marie Scott, good morning. We spoke to Jessica Parks before she left her hospital room here at Eskenazi, and she told us that she still forgives the woman who allegedly hit her. But now she's also calling out both Marion County as well as ICE. Here's why. Police say Juana Loa Nunez is the driver who hit Parks and attempted to leave the scene. Last week, we found out that Loa Nunez is in the country illegally. Shortly after being arrested, she bonded out of jail. The Marion County Sheriff's Office office and ICE disagree over whose fault it is that Nunez is out of jail now. Park believes both Marion County as well as ICE didn't do what they were supposed to do. And here's what Parks had to say before she left the hospital yesterday. So now she's out here free and she is a flight risk, not just to herself, but to other people as well. You know, she did this to me and she may do it to somebody else accidentally as well. In a new statement from ICE, they called out the information in the jail database from Marion County. They called it vague as well as unreliable. So we're going to have much more from this statement as well as the explanation behind it coming up at 5 o'clock. Back to you guys in the studio. All right. We'll see you with that update today at 5, Alyssa. Thanks.